All right, guys, we are still in Durban, South Africa, one of the best places to be in tropical South Africa. Hey, we're going whale watching. This right here was something special. And of course, we want you guys to love, like, and subscribe to our channel. We really appreciate bringing you the content and I hope you enjoy watching. Going on a cruise. Yeah, it's a small boat, ain't it? Yeah, one on a cruise. My cabin's below. And um, yeah, it's gonna be fun. No, actually, we're getting ready to go check out some wells and this is the dock where we're just leaving at here in Durban. There go some of the city skyline that you guys see in the in the in the backdrop. And then of course I got um Tasha right here. She's back always Good morning. Hey. Good morning, good morning, good morning. <laughs> yeah, so I always tend to, to get a little bit of motion sickness on these things. Uh, but I'm gonna do what I always do. <laughs> And then enjoy it from that point on. So yeah, so we're gonna try to um, show you guys some whales and some, uh, some dolphins and all that. They live in South Africa as well. So and get it as well. Get it. <laughs> anyway, it's gonna be fun. All right, guys. For some odd reason, the sound didn't come out, but you know what? I remember what happened. So I'm gonna tell you blow for blow. So right now we're leaving the, the, the port and it's a beautiful day, obviously. And uh, it was a great view of the Durban skyline there in Mslanga, um, which is part of Durban. It's absolutely beautiful. We it was like, dang, man, we didn't realize that. That's where we, we're at all the time. And of course we're on our boat ride. Tasha's over there. She's um, doing what she's doing. She's egging me on because she knows I generally have problems on these boat rides. But guess what? I did not. But it's, it's going to be an amazing adventure, you know, coming to South Africa, going out, checking out the animals that are in the water, the safari that we're getting ready to go on. So stay with this whole video. It's going to be amazing, of course. And we would love for you guys to like and subscribe to our channel as well. Now, this is cool. This is the whole Durban beach line right here going all the way up to the stadium. That's as far as I can actually see. Because it actually goes a little further way down there. Up to Belito. But we can't see it. But yeah, but that's, yeah. If you wonder if it's civilized, if people want to act like it's not, there's your answer right there. <laughs> this is something. <laughs> trying to tell you, we got you. Just come on over with us. We'll, we'll sort you out. Just like all the people we have here now and all the people that are en route. We got people flying in all the time. And um, we take care of them, make sure their trip is perfect. And of course, we'll do the same for you as well. But check out that. Check out that South Africa right there. That's Africa.
That's pretty cool way up so far. Add that to the list. An experience. in real life. <laughs> Probably do it again. on his back.
Nice. From the from the shark uh, drive that we went on, <laughs> was it sharks? <laughs> he is so silly. Um, we got to see uh, a couple dolphins, but the highlight was seeing. Were there dolphins out there? There was. Uh, we only saw like one or two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. the highlight was the whales that we saw. They really showed out today. Yeah. Um, hopefully, you guys will enjoy the footage of that. But yeah, it was yeah. it was it was incredible. Yeah, sorry for the win, but uh, again, South Africa, Durban is a whole vibe. It's everything. Uh, we do tourism big here, and all you gotta do is go to the website, therealsouthafrica.com, and get set up with your tour. So we'll chat with you later. Hello, 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 good people of the real South Africa. I am in Belito. Can you believe it? Somebody recommended this to me. So I said, you know what? It's the weekend and I might as well go and relax because I know what a farmer's market is. I'm at the Belitos Farmer's Market. So let me show you where I am, of course. So yeah, you can get all your farm, uh, like fresh uh, vegetables. And of course you can get all your crafts, but this is what really matters. This is where you get your food at. So we're gonna go inside, take a peek on what they have here and whatnot now these markets are all over the country uh especially on a sunday i know we have one in johannesburg that we like a lot it's called uh modern Fenstein. they have live music and so forth so yeah and then you got this over here you got the the bubble tea shack which i love the bubble tea if you haven't had bubble tea you need to get some and then of course let me see let me take a peek 
<laughs> yeah, that's the real deal right there. And then of course, Tasha, she loves her desserts. She can't seem to decide what she wants. <laughs> what do you want, Tasha? What do you want? Look, I'm, I'm just lucky right now because it's too You know how I am. I know, but you got your coffee earlier. I did. It was wonderful as always. And then, of course, you know, you got this types of, uh, like I said, just various types of food here that you can come out here and chill. Keep in mind that uh, I can't wait till the summertime comes because when we're here, we'll probably just pop in here a few times, probably with some friends, some people that we know or don't know. It don't really matter and meet them. See, I like these right here. Yeah, a, there we go, some treats. Yeah, there you go. I had the treats right there. Yeah, so give me one of those potato okay. chip twisters. You know what flavor to get, right? I do. Okay. Natasha so sorted me out with that. Those are really good. Last time we had that, we was in, um, um, well, Savannah was here, and we was able to secure us some chips and we really like them but yeah but this is basically what's going on uh, a lot of indian flavored type stuff simply because there's a large um, contingency of indians here you're going to hear me say that a lot but keep in mind we do have packages on our website very easy to navigate and yeah once you once you um get your package you're on your way to durban we take care of everything from there it's not like you got to figure out anything because we take care of it for you. So, yeah. So now that we're, we're through that tent, what do you think? <laughs> you know, it's just a different vibe. It's a different vibe. And then, of course, out here, you have your um, standalone little shops here, which I think earlier we had the taco fix, which is cool. Not a bad situation. Something to do on a nice Sunday, you know bring your significant other out like I did, um, Tasha. And then if you look way over there, maybe I will walk over there. I'm not really sure just yet because I got to go catch up with Tasha. Uh, yeah, get all your wares and, and your crafts and handmade stuff, and clothes and you name it is all there. But this is cool. But again, this is this is the South of Africa or the Africa they don't want to show you or tell you about. You know, you think if you go to a market, it's supposed to be downtrodden and and this, that, and the third. Well, that's not always the case. And unfortunately, you know, we get we get fed bad information, and uh, so we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna change that. And it really just starts with you guys coming here as tourists. You know, you ain't got to come here and think day one I gotta move here. What is it like to move here? Come here, and relax. And if you decide later on, great. But I'm always going to advocate that you come here as a as a as a tourist. And, and get the vibe because that's the best way to do it i can't i can't explain it to you enough so anyway this is Mark blanton with the real south africa i'll chat with you later spending time with us today if you like what you saw please subscribe and don't forget to hit the notifications button so you don't miss out on all things the real south africa thanks again